Right now at 5, a new advisory and forecast track just in on Hurricane Barrel. Barrel becoming the first hurricane of the season this morning. And CBS4 Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer is tracking it and a new tropical depression for us tonight. Craig? Yeah, pretty busy in the tropics tonight. First off, let's start with Barrel, which is headed towards the islands. Here we are in South Florida. There is Barrel, and if it you didn't zoom in on it or point it out. It's kind of hard to find because it's such a tiny, tiny hurricane. That's good news with respect to the fact that it's headed towards land. So a very, very small area of land will likely be impacted. It's quite possible it could thread the eastern islands of the Caribbean and the core of it could miss land there. But here's the latest advisory as of 5 o'clock. Winds at 80 miles an hour near that very small center moving west at 15 miles an hour, about 965 miles east of the islands there. Here's the future track taking us through tonight. Tomorrow, tomorrow night, Sunday afternoon, the general time frame here approaching the islands and Sunday night likely crossing through the islands there. And then after that, it is into the Caribbean. South of Puerto Rico is the forecast track right now. And then because the forecast track has shifted a bit south, forecast to potentially impact Dominican Republic and Haiti and even Jamaica and eastern Cuba now be, have to watch this system because there's still a lot of uncertainty and with a very small system it's just difficult for the models to resolve all of the possibilities. Here are the wind pro speed probabilities and of course you may remember Dominica last year devastated during the hurricane season from Maria again under the threat for hurricane force winds in fact a hurricane watch now in effect there tropical storm watches north and south of those Caribbean islands. All right.